Hey you, I'm celebrity menswear stylist Ashley Weston. So who's ready for summer? I know I am. I think it pretty much goes without saying that we're all ready for some warmer weather, right? I don't know about you, but I've been ready since like last November. But what I'm really asking is, are your feet ready for this time of year that I love to refer to as ankle season. I mean, you've already got your chinos, your polo shirts, and your flat front shorts. But what's that? You're still wearing those lace-up boots you bought to get you through the Canadian winter? Yeah, I think it's time for an upgrade. Okay, so before you go out and buy a new pair of open-toed sandals, Wrong. allow me to share with you some of my favorite footwear options that are perfect for those warm weather social situations. The shoes on this list are not only stylish, but also comfortable and perfect for throwing on over a pair of no-show socks. You've already got those, right? Because trust me, you're gonna need them. Did somebody say hot guy summer? Okay, let's get your feet ready for some ankle tan lines. So to start us off, let's discuss one of the most common misconceptions men have when it comes to footwear, and that is the idea that summer equals sandals. No, God, please, no, no! No! Guys, this really is just not the case, and take it from me, sandals are out this summer and every summer forever. Seriously, think of women as like the opposite of Quentin Tarantino in that the last thing we ever want to see is your toes. But Ashley, what about if I'm at the beach? Drop down. Step Okay, okay, so if you're at a body of water like a beach or a lake, then instead of a pair of dad sandals, go for some high quality and very stylish leather slides instead. Leather slides just have a much more elevated feel than cheap looking sandals, and if you invest in a well-made leather pair, then they will last you for several, several summers as you will only be wearing them ever near a body of water, right? Remember to go for real leather and to stay away from any plastic looking material as as this will usually look too tacky. Also, not only do they look uncomfortable, but those plastic materials on your feet are uncomfortable. Now, color-wise, I like dark brown slides as they always complement your lighter summer wardrobe on beach days, and beach days only. All right, I'm glad to have gotten that one out of the way. Move it on. The country of Spain, one of my favorite places on the planet, has gifted the world with incredible art, music, food, and even the idea of afternoon nap. But did you know that they're also the home of one of my personal zapatos favoritos, the espadrille. Every summer, I see more and more guys trying out espadrilles, and I honestly believe that once you try on a pair, you're never gonna go back to a boring old pair of sandals. Rocked by everyone from Salvador Dali to Idris Elba, they have a comfortable and breathable woven construction that makes them ideal for warmer temperatures. Also, they just exude timeless summer style and you can get them in pretty much every color and pattern imaginable. One of my favorite things about espadrilles is their sheer versatility when pairing them with pants. They just look great with everything from lightweight dress pants to chinos to jeans to shorts. And if this is your first pair, then I definitely recommend going with a neutral shade like tan, gray, or blue, as these are much easier to pair with the other items in your summer wardrobe. Material-wise, you can go for a more luxurious pair crafted from linen or suede, or something more affordable like canvas. And you really can't go wrong with brands like Saludos or Toms. Muchas gracias, España. Next up, we have a shoe that you probably own already, but it still definitely belongs on any summer shoe list, and that is a minimal low-top sneaker. So for me, these sneakers are a year-round essential, but their casual, stripped-back aesthetic makes them particularly great for pairing with summer outfits. Personally, I love the look of white leather low-tops as they have a clean and versatile aesthetic that elevates anything they're paired with, but canvas or suede versions can also work equally well during the warm weather months. If you want something that's a bit more casual, then you can always go for a comfy, low-key, slip-on sneaker instead. Available in a number of materials like canvas and leather, these can add a laid-back feel to your summer outfits and can easily be paired with jeans, chinos, and shorts. When choosing a color for your sneaker, I always recommend going for something neutral like white, sand, or navy to ensure maximum versatility. If you do want to go for some sort of color or pattern, then just make sure it's not something that doesn't distract from the rest of your outfit. For example, if you're planning on wearing a printed short sleeve button-up shirt, then stick with a solid color for your sneakers. 
Remember, only one item in your outfit should have a print, just as a general rule of thumb. This also works the other way around too. So if you plan on wearing a solid color shirt and pants combo, then you have my permission to play with the patterns in your shoes. Also, and this is critical, no-show socks are essential for any sneaker wearer. You definitely don't want your socks peeking out over your shoes as this just looks sloppy. However, you also don't wanna go sockless and run the risk of developing sweaty swamp feet and stinking up your shoes. So do your feet a favor and get yourself a couple pairs of super affordable no-show socks. So if you're looking for a footwear option that's on the dressier side but still feels appropriate for summer, then look no further than the next pick on my list, the humble chukka boot. A good pair of chukkas definitely belongs in every man's wardrobe as it's the stylish middle ground between a classic work boot and a fashionable dress shoe. Chukka boots pair great with your summer suits, jeans, and chinos, just not with shorts ever. During the summer months, I definitely go with a lighter suede version and color-wise, tan or dark brown is what you wanna go for as this will complement the lighter summer wardrobe you'll be wearing. Next up, we have a personal favorite of mine, truly the most timeless and stylish of all the summer shoes, the loafer. Classic loafers like suede driving mocks or leather penny loafers are in my eyes, the quintessential summer shoe. The perfect middle ground between a pair of casual and formal shoes, these bad boys will immediately elevate any outfit you pair them with from suits to shorts and everything in between. And they look particularly good when worn with some cupped pants like chinos. When it comes to colors, I feel your go-to shade for leather penny loafers should be a brown or cognac shade, but for the slightly more casual and laid back suede driving mock, you can definitely go for lighter shades like tan, gray, or navy. Also, did I mention how gosh darn comfortable these things are? Seriously, especially suede driving mocks. It's like wearing sandals, but a thousand times more stylish. My clients absolutely love them and you will too. And while we're on the subject of escaping out of your footwear comfort zone, let's move on to my next pick, boat shoes. So despite their name, you do not need to own a boat or even be on a boat for that matter to rock a pair of these. Though their preppy aesthetic admittedly makes them a divisive piece in the men's style world, for me, boat shoes really tick all of my summer footwear boxes. Not only are they stylish with a sophisticated yet casual look, but they also are super comfortable and have a design that allows you to easily slip them on or off. Material wise, you can go for leather or suede and I'd recommend going for a pair in either blue or brown. Also, if you're wondering what outfits you can pair your boat shoes with, just know that they are pretty much interchangeable with loafers and sneakers. So this means that you can easily mix and match them with the majority of your seasonal essentials, including chinos, summer suits, shorts, and jeans. Also, though boat shoes can be comfortable without socks, try to resist the urge to wear them with bare feet. Don't tempt me further. Stinky feet will definitely ensue, which as well as being unpleasant for everyone around you will ultimately ruin your new shoes. And there we have it, your summer essential shoes. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.